Yeah, yeah, that was nice that we built a big lead in the fifth set. I didn't have to sweat too much, but they really made me sweat uh, in sets three and four. But that's volleyball. I mean, it's never easy, and that's a really good team. They were ranked uh, nationally for about half the season. Um, and uh, yeah, we we're up 2 0 and then you know, laid back a little bit, but they actually took it to us in those sets three and four, so it was nice that we bounced back in the fifth. Yeah, that's a classic kind of thing. You try to get the team to play well, even though you're you know, really far behind in the fourth set, yeah. r running into the fifth. I think that's a really good observation that we uh, kind of picked it up where we left off in the fourth set. Even though we lost it, we were, got our momentum back. I think the, the key was that we got back to playing like we did in the first two sets. We hit balls at the court, uh, landing was unstoppable, and uh, just it was so fun watching them play. I'm trying to tell them to, trying to teach them to, to always aim at the court, you know, never be uh, you know, aiming for out of bounds. Not, it's not that they do it on purpose, but you always should be aiming for the court. And we got in trouble in the third and fourth set hitting balls out, and it's like the first set the loops. Just, um, and what else? I'm trying to remember. I think our passing steadied down in the fifth set. You know, we passed well. We blocked well. Lyndon had a maybe the best block of the season on there. Uh, a super player, uh, Peterson. He just happened to surround the ball, and, it, and there's a lot of talk going on through the net that kind of goes over my head. But I, um, but I heard it in the locker room. They were all happy that they won because of all that you know, talking through the net and stuff.